Hey guys, welcome back to another video. It was Christmas yesterday and I got a, quite a few good things. And here's a little glance of them right here. I hope you all had a great Christmas. But in today's video, I'm going to try and survive with all the outdoor um, Christmas gifts I got. And I got quite a few of them. Here, let me show you. So here I have a hatchet. A really nice one for chopping wood. Then we got an ice fishing pole. Since my other one broke. Then I've got this portable and reusable hand warmer. It's so cool. It gets really warm. I opened one of them because I got two. And they get so warm. I'm planning on using it for ice fishing, hunting, or whenever it gets cold. Then I got three survival bracelets. It has all sorts of cool things like compasses, lights, flint and steel, and all sorts of survival gear like knives, saw, and uh, and a bottle opener. Then I've got a big credit card survival tool. It has a saw, a blade, a bottle opener, and pretty much everything like the ruler and all sorts of cool things. And it even comes with a little sheath or whatever you call it for it. Then, this is the favorite. I got a GoPro. My other GoPro broke because I jumped in the water with the latch open but now I can use this GoPro for when I'm hunting and like squirrel hunting or something and I don't need to bring a huge tripod to try and film it. And something else I got cool is that I got this uh what's it called GoPro thing that you put on your chest I'm planning on using this for fishing, so you can see all the cool stuff for it. The next thing I got is this Leatherman. It's a little tiny Leatherman. has all the cool stuff in it. And it comes with this cool little sheath here. It's so cool. I got a lot of cool stuff. So basically, I'm going to use all of that stuff in the woods near my house. It's public property, so I can go on there without using real weapons. So, yeah, um, I'm going to try and survive with all that. I left a frog gig over here last time I was here, so I'm going to go look for that, um, but I'm not going to use it because I didn't get it for Christmas, but that's one of the main goals for today too. Okay, so I am going towards a pond for my food source um, to catch some fish. As you could tell early in the video, I got a fishing pole. So, I could catch fish here right now to survive. But I didn't bring the fishing pole because I didn't want to break it. So I'm just going to pretend to fish. Because I obviously can't right now. But yeah. Guys, look at that. I caught a sunfish. Woohoo! Now I can eat. Check one is complete. Oh, there it is. My frog gig. Oh, glad I found it. Thought I'd lose it forever. There we go. Oops, dropped it again. 
Oh, I'm gonna try to get through here alive. Oh, maybe I should throw this so I don't stab myself if I fall. Oh, there's Mr. Trident. It's my very cool trident that I have left here. Um, yeah. But right behind the trident is the good old fort. See, this is the fort right here. Um, where I'm thinking about building the shelter. And yeah. And so let's start building it. Okay, so the next step, as seen here, I'm at the shelter. And I'm going to try and pick as many logs like that, or all these sticks that have fallen. I'm going to stack it all on here to make a good shelter that can block a little bit of wind and snow, and possibly rain. That can help me get warm, and we can ch um, check out the shelter. But yeah. That's a pretty good one to cut down. Not too big. Yeah, that might be the one to cut down. Okay guys, so I am inside of the fort that I built. Um, took a little bit to put all the logs in here, but uh, since we're in here, we might as well get warm. So I'm gonna check off the shelter and go on to the warmth section because every survival situation, every person needs warmth to survive. So here I've got my pebble, um, reusable hand warmer. To turn it on, all you have to do is press this button and hold it. And wait for the red to turn on. There we go. The red means it's on. And it's at full blast. So, in a little bit, it's going to get really warm. So, let's wait in here a little bit for it to get warm. While we were waiting for the hand warmer to warm up, Let's go and try and trim some sticks and make this place cool using our Leatherman and credit card multi-tool. Okay, next we have the credit card multi-tool. I'm going to use the 
saw on this to saw some of these little branches off. Alright. Oh, that's my branch. Ow. They're kind of pokey, so I want to get rid of them. Let's just. Oh, yeah, this one up. They're pretty tough, so this works pretty well. Okay, so I think the hand warmer is ready enough. It's not at full heat right now, but I'm kind of tired of waiting. It usually takes 10 minutes to heat it all up, but I'm not going to be here that long. So it's on. Oh, that's nice. It's not all the war way warm, but it's still like... Ah, that's really cool. Well, I guess the uh, warmth check mark is checked off. Okay, so the last survival challenge we have to do is use these cool bracelets I got and try and use every single multi tool for all the different things. So, yeah. The next one here, uh, is the um, whistle. I'm going to try it. Uh, my dad did it, so hopefully this is the one he used. I probably shouldn't have done that because I'm like right next to houses. Yeah, I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> this is kind of like an SOS thing. Okay, so the one we're going to use on this one is the flint and steel. And we're not going to do the fire now because I don't want to burn the for forest down. So we're just going to maybe make a spark or something. I don't know. Okay. So all we need to do is just... Uh, flick this little metal piece to this big metal piece. Oh, that was a spark. Oh, there are some sparks. I don't know if you guys can see it or not, but... Oh, that was a big one. Oh, this is so cool. Wow. One more, one more. Oh, did you see that? Wow. That is just amazing. I'm just going to stomp on this for good measures. Wow, that is so cool. Well, we're still here and survive, so the survival thing is checked out, and that means it we're done. We finished. We did all the check marks. Um so I guess that means it's the end of today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. And I got my GoPro and this is the first video with it. So if you liked it, hit that like button. And yeah. If you like these types of videos, comment that down below. We can do more survival challenges like these. Well, see you guys next time.